African Black Hand. Have you read it? Is it any good? I... I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ofrenda, though. Jack. Pure and simple. Right. Well, you got something for your Ofrenda. But we could look around a little more. No, let's take pay, uh, part of the get going. Friend. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What'd she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. You really want to. You gotta to come. come, Misty. You got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So, shall we go? Uh, yep. You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? Meaning? Packed my bags and hopped on a plane to Nepal. To Thought Nepal. I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. All right, let's take part in the friend. Of Then go raise a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. Hey, it's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Hey, V. Oh, there's Vic. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a, like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, no te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Ah, I want to look at that. Okay. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying, make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true, Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, 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 honor. 
Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? Uh, always go back to the time we first met. I, uh, I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. Feels like it happened a century ago. At another time, in another place. Jackie saved my life. And then, years later in Night City, he saved it again. At a time when I thought I'd lost absolutely everything. I found my own freedom then. But it would not have happened without him. Jackie Wells. His friends were everything. He had principles. He aimed high. His friends Best friend everything. you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind to something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Broder, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. He never forgot where he came from. He put his loved ones first. Always, always knew what he wanted. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life without hesitation. But most importantly, He did not fear life. He wasn't who people thought he was. Everyone saw Jackie as a grinning charmer who saw the good in everyone. Everything. But they were wrong. Jackie Wells was a hell of an ambitious chum who never gave up. And whose drive cost him his life. But he did in life what he said he'd do. Reach for fortune and fame. No fear in eyes or heart. Uh, leave an offering. When you go to war as a boy, you have a great illusion of immortality. Other people get killed, not you. Then, when you are badly wounded the first time, you lose that illusion. Rest easy, Chu. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful offrenda we gave him. Talk to the bartender optional. Would you another? For Jackito. Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar. In his favorite spot, where he always used to sit. Poor. For Jackie. Amen, brother. Campos all torn up. I'll have another. He feels like he lost have one as of his many own. as you want. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after you die. Oh, let's get trapped. Don't go starting something, eh? Not today. Not one. I'll have another. Have as many as you want. I'll have another. Have as many as you want. Do they actually mean have as many as you want? I'll have another. Have as many as you want. I'll have another. Have as many as you want. All right, we'll try one more. I'll have another. Have as many as you want. Is it, anyone knows how the alcohol level on the bottle does not change? Alright, let's go and talk to Mama Wells. 
Oh no. There's a few of them. She's a strong. Talk to the Valentino. Hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? Alright, why not? To Wells! May he rest in peace. How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible Book Club. Yeah, I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. I think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. Good for now, thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. Aye, right, give me a break. All right, let's go. Uh... How do we talk to uh, Pad Padu? I don't know. How to Pad Padu? I know it means father. Padre? There he is. You uh, here to say goodbye to one of your own? Padre. I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. How are things in the streets? This is not the place to conduct business. Have some respect. Jackie, uh, do you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us? From up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it. I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. Go with God. Alright, let's talk to Victor. I'm pretty sure I saw him at the bar. Where are you, Vic? There he is. <sighs> it uh, sucks to meet like this, huh? Farewells aren't that bad once you get used to them. <laughs> Have you gotten used to them? When you get to my age, friends don't come and go. They just mostly go. Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. Well, uh, I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. A lot of people come today. Even that putika Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. And she was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. You... You sure? Jackie would kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, V. We got a motorbike. Alright, is that the whole... Let's talk to Mr. Hey. Are you alright? Yeah. I think I'm just still in that garage, mentally. I just need a sec. All right. I guess there's no one else to talk to, right? No, we we'll talk to everyone. We just got a bike, though, which is pretty cool. Ah. 
Let's have a look at the bike. How do we get it? Ah, uh, Jackie's. Where is it? There we go. Oh, cool. Alright guys, that will do it for this episode. If you liked it, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.